the ways that John and I became friends was our love of music. So John would be up all night and not sleeping, and then uh, he would show up and he'd have a CD made for me, just like this one that says 80s stuff. And this one makes me laugh because it says tracks 11 through 17 are rated PG-13. So uh, those he knew I could listen to in front of the kids. So, um, but yeah, he, he had his own versions of everything. So like I said, the John B. Presents app is real funny. Um, I've got one of his CDs playing. Okay, so he, he liked sounds. So, um, you know, you might hear one of his CDs might say early spring 2003, and he'll tell you that there's a train in number set, track number seven. Uh, so um, that was a beautiful part of John that I don't think was featured, and I want people to know. I want, I want people to know how he, he loved the noises of nature, and, and you can hear, um, I'm sure that was taped right outside his house. So, um, then of course, if I mentioned a, a band and I mentioned the Goo Goo Dolls to me, and so he made, um, or he brought me everything the Goo Goo Dolls had ever released at that time. So it was just a special part of our friendship. But then of course we were in the same age. So you'll see that he'd bring me Breakfast Club or Pet Shop Boys. So, uh, and then of course, typical John, this one says Booty Mix. <laughs> So yeah, just really, really um, trying to go back in time and um, see the, the, the joy and the, and the good stories that we shared together. So.